Good day viewers, you are welcome. Here we have a nice functional equations which we are interested to find f of t minus 1 given that f of t divided by t minus 3 equals t to the power of 2. And uh, the first time uh, I saw this question, so I just decided to share it with you and how to solve it step by step. Here we have t minus 3 as what we do first is we have to know the domain of these functions, which is if we start to plug in 3 here, we are going to have t divided by, uh, if, we, if we plug in 3, we are going to have 3 divided by 3 minus 3, and this equals 3 divided by 0, and which gives us undefined, that is t equals 3 is not part of this domain. And let's see how we can uh, find uh, f of t minus 1. So let's say we let t divided by t minus 3 to be equals x. Then we make x the subject, uh, the t the subject of this formula by cross multiplying as we have t equals x into bracket of t minus 3. Having this, we open this parenthesis, t equals x t minus 3x. Then we are going to take this minus 3 to this side. We have 3 plus 3x equals x t. And again, let's take this t to the other side. We have 3x equals xt minus 3. Then, we can factor out t from here. By factoring out t, we have t into bracket of x minus 1. Then, we divide both sides by x minus 1. So, by doing so, we are going to have x minus 1 cancelled x minus 1 and we have t equals 3x divided by x minus 1. So we have make t the subject then let's try and substitute back into the original functions where we are going to have f of instead of t over t minus 3 we change it to f of x equals and for t we are going to change it to 3x divided by x minus 1 raised to the power of 2. Then let's replace every single x with t. We have f of t equals 3t divided by t minus 1, then all raised to the power of 2. So since we have obtained f of t, and let's see how we can get f of t minus 1. This is the simplest part. Let's just change t to t minus 1 and you expand. So by changing t to t minus 1, we are going to have 3 into bracket of t minus 1 divided by t minus 1 minus 1 raised to the power of 2. As we have f of t minus 1 equals so I expand this, we have 3t minus 3 divided by t minus 2, all raised to the power of 2. But we have to note that t also is not equals, it's not equals 2. So for us not to have an undivined expression at this side. So this is how to solve this. Thanks for watching and uh, see you in the next video. Never stop playing. Bye-bye.